योर क्वेश्चन इज यूज द सिमेट्री ऑफ ईच क्वाड्रेटिक फंक्शन एंड फाइंड द मैक्सिमम और मिनिमम पॉइंट्स स्केच ग्राफ शोइंग ऑल एक्सेस क्रॉसिंग पॉइंट्स नाउ तो व्हाट दे हैव गिवन यू वाई इज इक्वल टू ट्वेल्व प्लस एक्स माइनस एक्स स्क्वायर नाउ फर्स्ट वी विल मेक इट इन स्टैंडर्ड फॉर्म our standard form is that we have to arrange it in the form of a decreasing order of the power that means y is equal to now here it is minus x square then plus x then plus 2 we will complete this equation by squaring method so you can see here minus is here so we will take it as a minus as a common y is equal to minus now it will be x square minus x plus 12 now you can see here minus x that means what we will do we will make it in the form of a minus b whole square a Minus b whole square and minus b square. You can see here minus is there. That means we will put here minus a minus b whole square minus into minus is plus here now. And here it comes here plus twelve. In this form we have to do it. You can see here a is your x. A is equal to x, and minus two ab, minus two ab, minus two ab is your what? Minus two ab is your minus x, minus x. Now minus and minus gone, a and x gone. Now we can say b is equal to one by two. Now substitute this value in our formula. We will get y is equal to minus x minus one by two whole square. Then here comes your positive plus one by four plus twelve. Okay, now take the LCM. What you will get? Y is equal to minus x minus one by two whole square plus now four. That means one plus forty eight. That is equal to forty nine by four. Now we have to go for a what? Minimum or maximum? How we can find out? we can see here it is a minus x square that means we will get a maximum point here maximum point so what are the maximum points so we will write here maximum points are what for x coordinate we will take this one that means x minus 1 by 2 that is equal to 0 X minus one by two that is equal to zero. That means x is equal to one by two. What is your y? Y is nothing but this value. One plus forty-eight by four. That means forty-nine by four. So y is equal to we can say it's a forty-nine by four. So these are the two coordinates x and y for the maximum point. Now what we will do? We will take y is equal to zero now. Y is equal to zero. That means this is zero. So what we will get? We will bring this value to your right side. It will be minus x minus one by two whole square, and this is plus. Bring it to right side. It will become a minus. That is equal to minus. Forty-nine by four. Here it is minus and minus gone. Now we can say as 
x my x minus 1 by 2 is equal to root over 49 by 4 that is equal to plus and minus 7 by 2 plus and minus 7 by 2 now what we will do for the first case we will take as a positive and the second case we will take as a negative so first we will take as a positive we will get x is equal to 7 by 2 and this is minus 1 by 2 it will become a plus 1 by 2 that is equal to we can say it's a 8 by 2 that is equal to 4 next case is your negative case so we will take as a negative what we will get x is equal to minus 7 by 2 plus 1 by 2 that is equal to what minus 6 by 2 that is equal to minus 3 now the two coordinates of y is equal to 0 is what minus 3 by 0 and 4 by 0 minus 3 comma 0 and 4 comma 0 so these are the two coordinates when y is 0 now we will take y is equal x is equal to 0 for x is equal to 0 what we will do here we will make it as 0 that means what minus of minus 1 by 2 whole square is minus 1 by 2 whole square is 1 by 4 and minus that means minus 1 by 4 we will get y is equal to minus 1 by 4 and here we will get plus 49 by 4 solving this we will get y is equal to 48 by 4 that is equal to 12 now the coordinates are 0 comma 12 0 comma 12 so these are the coordinates for the axis and this is for the maximum point they have given you axis now we will draw a graph suppose this is your rough graph i am drawing now the first coordinate is what minus 3 comma 0 so minus 3 suppose it is here next is 4 comma 0 4 is somewhat here next comes your 0 comma 12 0 comma 12 12 is somewhat suppose here it is 12 and the maximum point is what you can see 1 by 2 that means 0 0.5 and this is your 12.5 12.25 so 1.5 and 12.25 point 0.5 is here and 12.25 is somewhat here so if you draw this you will get the graph like this so you you got the maximum point this is your maximum point like this you have to solve this question